Star, and welcome to my channel, Starlight Starbright 70. If you are returning, thank you so much for coming back, and if you are new, welcome, come on in. Uh, today I'm just going to continue on with that uh, order that Timu decided to put three orders into one and ship to me. Uh, so these are the diamond paintings that I got in that order. Uh, if you don't know what Timu is, it's an online marketplace that has thousands of sellers. I will be putting up a link here somewhere on the screen along with my promo code as well as in my description box. What that will give you is 30% off your first order when you use my code and then a uh, $100 coupon bundle towards your next orders uh, that you order through Timu. So yeah, so let's just get on with uh, the show here. <laughs> this is like the second time I've had to record this. The first time there was no sound. The second time there was um, some noise that probably shouldn't have been there. Um, but yeah, so now everything's quiet and uh, good to go. So everything is like it's, as out of the uh, bags already, as you can see. But, uh, but yeah, so the first ones are just tiny little 20 by 20s I call them my little snack size and they all come with with this the diamonds and then the painting so if you've never diamond painted before um, this is all you need to start for for diamond painting and I suggest to get a size like this for for your uh, starter one just to make sure that you enjoy it. They're only $2.11 uh, per painting, but they were all the same price, so they were all $2.11. And and you want to get a painting that is um, basically focused on one object. If you have too much going on in a painting, it will, it will come out that it looks uh, just too busy. And you might, you know, the the main object might get lost in that painting so like a little dog like this with a bit of flowers will turn out uh, really nice so something something like that I do suggest that that you do uh, get a better container though or not container a better boat or a tray is what they're called I guess they call them boat because it kind of look like a boat uh, but yeah, like it's because these this one is pretty um, flimsy, and you want a sturdier one. So for example, I was working on my other diamond painting here, so just take these out. So this is the one that I use, and you can see it's a lot more sturdy. It's a lot larger, so you can put the diamonds in. So when you put your diamonds in, you just shake your container like this, and it gets all. The diamonds all flatten out for you, so it's easy to pick them up with your pen. You just dip this pen in this wax here, and then you can start diamond painting. This is what I use for diamond painting. I just use tweezers uh, for square and for round. As you can see, it's got a nice sharp end to it. So very, very easy to pick up diamonds. And I just find it really comfortable and uh, yeah, works really, really nice. But anyway, so this one is, let's see if I can get the right diamonds with this one. So as you can see, these diamonds have uh, a number on them. So this one is uh, W0136 and this painting here you'll see is W0136. So that's if you're if you store your paintings in a different place and you store your diamonds, then it's just easy to match them up. So I always to I always make sure that there's a number somewhere on my package or you know or on the diamond packages that match that number. So this little doggy, he's got uh, 15 colors, and they're all letters. They are they are mixed up, but so it goes from one to 15, and then you have your letters, and then you have your DMC codes, and that's the color palettes of these diamonds. And then, uh, for example, so you want to 
let's do eyes. So you look for the letter I, which is at the very bottom. And then, and then, so it's number 15. And then you can just start filling in. This is a nice sparkly canvas. Just really nice. Good stick to it. And then these are the diamonds. So really, really nice. Got your greens, you got your purples, dark, well, black, probably for, of course, around his eyes and so forth. Lots of white, lighter purple in there. So, yeah, really, really nice. So, I think he's going to turn out really nice. The next one is a bear claw. I have another one like this, but in a bluish color. So when I saw this, it was like, yep, you're going in my cart and you're coming home. <laughs> so this one has 15 colors. And nice and colorful. A lot of Most of this is all color blocking, which is nice. Now we're trains going by, guys. So I'm sorry. <laughs> I guess they go, they go by at all hours. But yeah, so this one has, uh, again, it's all letters. And very easy to see, as you can see. Really nice drill fill, and you can see the, the table really nice. So, no issues with that. And then these are the colors. So again, this number here matches with that one. So you got your greens, lots of pinks. Got the blues, and browns. It's funny on camera, this almost looks like it's an, an orangey color, but here it's like a brown color. So it'll be interesting to see what it looks like on the painting. But yeah, really nice colors. So these ones, like I think I said already, they they were all two dollars and eleven cents. And this one's of a little white puppy, just like mine. The only thing with this one here is these are these here are just gonna blend into his forehead, and so I think I'm gonna put more J's up here, which is just one color off, just to make it look like he's got a forehead. But other than that, he's really cute. Got the nice little flowers. Again, very nice sparkly canvas. Nice and sticky. And <clears throat> got the nice purples. You can see that. Gorgeous purples. I love the color purple. Purple and pink. Then you got some grays. Some browns. This one here, I think, is supposed to be for the yellow flowers here. And I'm going to probably change that out to a brighter yellow. Just so that these ones stick out a little bit more. So anywhere there's a U will be changed to a different color yellow. I'm not too happy with this color yellow. That's a nice thing about diamond painting is if you keep your drills, you can kind of... If you don't like one color, you can replace it with another one, which is really nice. But yeah, again, they, it comes with all letters here. They're all they are all mixed up, but the, all the letters are there. So these ones usually only take me a couple hours to do in the evening. So when I'm working on a bigger painting, sometimes I'll just take one of those and work on them for one evening. While I watch all my uh, haulers and creators and stuff on YouTube. So this one here is a 40 by 70. Hopefully it will lay out nice. It has 24 colors and I think it's absolutely gorgeous. 
You got your cactus. You got your cactus flowers. You got your mountains here. And just lots of yellows. Lots of color blocking, which is really nice. Nice clear uh, drill fill, as you can see. Really, really nice. Canvas is sparkly as well. Uh, this one has 24 colors and all letters. And it also has the DMC numbers beside it, which is nice. The stickiness to this one is really nice, I believe. Yeah, really sticky. So, which is nice. What I'll do with this one, though, I'm not very good at straightening the covers. So, I usually just take them off, put my own placement papers on, and then it will be stored underneath my mattress and get all nice and flattened out. So this one is, is around as well, and it all comes in its own little baggies, which is nice, so it's already kitted up, is what we call it. Again, it just comes with a simple uh, tray and pen. But yeah, so these are the colors, just beautiful. Really, 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 really nice. I want to look forward to doing this one. Um, I'll probably start this one next month though, because this month I've already got planned what I want to get finished. <laughs> so, and this this month is going so fast, just unbelievable. But yeah, so this one was ten dollars and forty eight cents, and like I said. All these paintings will be linked in my description box, so just go down there and you can click on the link. And if they are for whatever reason sold out or um, discontinued, what I'll do is I'll I'll just put the seller there, so you can look at the other paintings they have or um, wait for it to come back into stock. And the last painting I have is, oh, did I say that one was a 40 by 70, by the way, just in case I missed saying that. And this one is a 50 by 70. And this one is absolutely gorgeous. It's got a lot of pinks, a lot of purples. It's of, I will say, a native lady. Native American. She's got a wolf here. I think I'm going to call her Pocahontas. <laughs> she looks like a Pocahontas to me. But yeah, the, the beautiful colors. She is very confetti heavy though. Lots of uh, confetti in this one. But the drill fill looks really, really nice. I don't know if you can see that. Really, really nice drill fill. But she's absolutely gorgeous. Like I said, a lot of pinks and a lot of purples. Beautiful blues in here. It's going to look really, really nice. So with this one, it too came kitted up already. So they're all in their bags here. And it did come with a, with a uh, paper chart. And I'll take that out for you guys. And that's what uh, it looks like. So there's her and the wolf. Really pretty. Beautiful colors. She's got a gorgeous feather in her hair. Absolutely beautiful. So I'm not sure what these bags mean. I'm presuming that's the weight of each bag. I don't believe there's 52 bags in here. Uh, this one is a square. But the squares look amazing. They look really, really nice. But yeah, they all look really nice. But here's just some of the colors. It's got the blues. The pinks. Purples. But yeah, all these drills. <clears throat> they look amazing. 
could see that. Really nice. So, you sometimes when you get a square from a budget uh, companies, they don't come out too nice. But uh, this one is awesome. I'm gonna. I'm very happy with this one. Uh, she was fifteen dollars and forty eight cents. Well worth it, I'd say. Oh, let's, let's look at that color. Isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely gorgeous color. And they all have a nice shine to them. I don't believe there's any ABs in this one. Doesn't look like it. Don't see any. Nope. No, so no, no, no special drills or anything. But I said she's gonna be absolutely beautiful when she's done. So this one has. She also. She's got forty colors. Um. First the numbers, then the um, letters, right down to Z, and then she has symbols for the rest. So she got one, two, seven, eight, nine, nine different symbols in, in this painting. But I don't know why they just can't go one through nine and then start with the alphabet, but I guess they like using symbols. <laughs> Um, this one is a softer canvas. It is, it's got like the really nice soft to it, and it has also the uh, sheared edges, which is really nice. And I think this one is. So, oh yeah, very nice and sticky. I can't tell if it's poured glue or not. I don't think so. I don't see that it's... Or no, double-sided, I think, is what I was thinking of. I don't believe this one is double-sided. But I still haven't really could tell what the difference is. But again, that is her. Absolutely gorgeous. Very, very pretty. Very happy with her. So I'll probably get this. It is uh, late Sunday night. Actually, probably by now it's Monday mo early morning, and so I will get this video out as soon as I can to on Monday or <laughs> later on today. <laughs> it's gonna be Monday, um, but yeah. So I have to edit it and everything yet. Hopefully my sound, last time, one time my sound wasn't working, the next time I forgot to hit record, and then there was noise going on, and oh, but anyhow, <laughs> we made it. So this is the painting I'm currently working on, it is for an event um, that Diamond Grandma and Shirley, uh, oh, can't think of her name, and I have my book over there. Anyway, I'll, I'm going to put their links in the uh, description. So you can go check them out. But uh, Diamond Grandma puts on events every month. Also, um, Diamonds with Tita. Or Diamond Painting with Tita. I think it's Diamonds with Tita. Uh, she's another creator. Um, I will put her link as well in my description. She also has an event this month. I believe it has to do with green. And Diamond Grandma's is petals. So this would this painting would go for both of them. As well as I just learned that um, Bewitch Cat, who has also got a channel on YouTube, uh, she's got an event running this month, so I'll put hers in as well. But yeah, this one is just coming out really lovely. This one is square. I've really had no issues at all with it. I've had a couple um, pop-outs, but not very many. Um, the diamonds have gone on very nice and very <clears throat> pretty straight. There's some areas that I need to straighten up a little bit. But uh, you can see the paws. <laughs> and uh, so I should have this done by middle of next week. Or I should say middle of this week, now that it's going to be Monday already. My goodness, time is flying so fast. Before you know it, uh, Easter is going to be here. 
which is I believe at the end of March this year so incredibly fast but uh, but anyway so that's it oh I wanted to show you one program that I found hopefully it will come up let me see it's called it's called gem flows whoops so this is it right here gem flows so you click on it so for example I can put all my dime paintings in here so these are the ones that I received and not started yet and then these are the ones that I have completed well, that I've gotten in here anyway that I've completed so for example this is the one I've started so I can click on it which is a 50 by 70 and then I can push this button here which I can edit so what I can put in here is so this is a 50 by 70 whoops I don't want to change anything so I put the picture in Let's see if I can get rid of uh, that um, and it tells me who this the seller is so I have seller or from Timu and who the seller is and then I can put the website in and then it tells me the price I paid for this painting and then it's square full and then it says the date oh I hope you can see that <laughs> Um, the time, the date that I ordered it, the date that I received it, the date that I started, and the date that I finished. And then I can give it a rating. So for this one, I just put that when I received it, the uh, parchment was stuck to this painting. So yeah, I had a struggle of, of taking the parchment off. But, uh, but yeah, so it's just, it's called Gem Flow. Gems flow so I'll, I'll leave that in my description as well for you guys I'll just put app gems flow so you know what I'm talking about um, really nice way of organizing your paintings and your your uh, uh, diamonds because you can you can put all your diamonds in there as well and also you can they do sell diamond paintings on here too I haven't really looked at them but uh, but yeah, there are diamond paintings for sale, so I'm not sure exactly where they come from, or uh, I presume still China, but who knows. But anyway, I want to thank you so much for being here with me today. Uh, like I said, it is late, <laughs> and I'm going to go to bed. But uh, I wish you a very blessed morning afternoon evening wherever you are whatever you are doing um i keep you in my prayers and uh, thank you again uh for my subscribers if you haven't subscribed go ahead hit that subscribe button for me uh hit that thumbs up leave me a comment i would love to know what are your plans for this week or uh, did the uh time change affect you in any way but, but anyway, God bless you all, and uh, I'll see you again. Bye.